We know that Ivan is in Ghana, the guy who Mara went to him in the United States and a whole lot of things happened. Drama, whole lot of drama. And the most strangest thing is that landing in Ghana, the first person he went to was Wadimaya. Everybody knows that Marwa and Wadimaya are not in good terms. Wadimaya made things so clear to Ivan. I feel that it was an indirect caution that he is giving Ivan. Marwa and Wadimaya, there is always a competition between them. But now my question is, why is Wadimaya lying that he doesn't know what Ivan does on his YouTube channel? Is Wadimaya trying to tell me that if I write to him, I want to collaborate with you? If I say I'm a YouTuber, Wadimaya would just say, okay, come. Without him checking what I do on my channel, is he trying to tell us that? That is a lie. You just accepted him and brought him to your home. And even you were revealing the kind of businesses, you were even ready to go show him your businesses that same day. Businesses you said you are doing them low key and you don't want anyone to know. Don't let the influence of Ivan make you be twisting your tongue. Only God knows the kind of conversations he will have with Wadmaya behind closed doors about Ayamara. Sinchao, Sinchao, your boy Melody. <laughs> Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, kindly consider subscribing. Hit that notification bell so you become part of the Strife family and the Crooked Truth Court. If you're already a subscriber, you know how we do it. I salute you, I salute you, I salute you, I salute you, I salute you. <laughs> You are one of the amazing people in the whole world and I really appreciate you for the love and support you guys give me on this channel. Like I always say, on this channel, we only embrace people who are sensible, people who are smart, people who are wise, people who are intelligent, people who are open-minded and reasonable. If you don't have these qualities, please don't waste time over because you would disagree with insult, which we don't tolerate over here. If you want to disagree, just use the instinct. Put out your submission. Then if I accept it, we go with it. If I don't accept it, I also bring more opinions. Then we see what we can do. We try as much as possible to be truthful without any insult, without any attacks. If you are right, we tell you that you are right. If you are wrong, same way we will tell you that you are wrong. We don't pamper anybody here. And on this note, I don't want peace. I want problems always. Yes, guys. So this is what we do over here. We've been out for so long. I was just planning to come back, you know, uh, in the next month. But there are issues popping up that I need to come out and put my voice on it. Whether people accept it or not, you know, we always come here to put out our own opinion without any insult and attack. Now, we know that Ivan is in Ghana. Ivan, Iventures, we know him. The guy who Mara went to him in the United States with uh, uh, their friend, Sultan, and a whole lot of things happened. They fell out and uh, drama, whole lot of drama that people were not understanding, but it is what it is. Now, Ivan is in Ghana and the most strangest thing is that Ivan landing in Ghana, the first person he went to was Wadimaya. On the YouTube streets, look, everybody knows that Marwa and Wadimaya are not in good terms. You understand, they are not in good terms. But when Ivan went to Wadimaya, you know, they did a video and there are some things in the video that I need to address so that we all talk about it. If you agree, you leave a comment. If you don't agree, you leave a comment. I want us to watch this video, then we talk more about it. So, yeah, and I have to say this, guys. As a, as a small YouTuber, one of my biggest challenges is to meet the big YouTubers like this. No. And no, no, seriously. Like, you have people with like, 
Yeah, and I'm not gonna say any names. I've reached out to some people with like 100,000 subs, 200,000 subs, and they just ignore me. It's like, well, what am I gonna get from this guy? I have what, 11,000 subscribers as we speak right now? 11,000 is a lot. I need to check out your channel. Yeah. 11,000 is a lot. Listen, I always tell people it's not about the numbers. Yeah. It's about the value both of you can create together. Yeah. Even if you say I'm a big YouTuber. Yeah. If I collab with you, I'm also benefiting as a big YouTuber because you have a family member. You yeah. say, oh, I collaborated with one of my. Yeah. Even if it's two people, one people, it's Atta. Right. I, I used to collab with every creator, but at some point, YouTubers love drama so much. They do. I, like, and I can't stand that. And, and bro, I don't have the heart for it. Yeah. And I was like, you know what? Everybody should stay wherever they want to stay and yeah. I stay wherever I want to stay. That's yeah. how I stopped collaborating with YouTubers. Like, I used to. When I travel, yeah. all I'm looking for is YouTubers. Yeah. I don't care if you have one subscriber, two subscribers. Yeah. I'm willing to crash with you. Yeah. But then when you leave, they start drama. You have done this, you have done that. I'm like, no. It, you don't need that for I don't, views, I don't man. need that. I don't get it. I don't, I don't need it. It's yeah. like I just came for the value we can bring to the audience. Yeah. I don't have time for what am I has done this, what am I. That's why I actually stop creating content with, with people. With people. Just go to a location, create my entrepreneurship series, get the views and get out. Is it harder for you now to trust people then because of YouTube? Bro, I've been stopped at the back yeah. by YouTubers, yeah. close friends and all of that. And it's so hard, but yes. let me tell you something, you learn a lesson along the journey. Yes. Because for me, I have a heart of, like the way I responded to you, I don't know you anywhere, right. but First of all, reason why I responded, you're Cameroonian, you're an African, yeah. you're coming to Ghana, yeah. and I have to embrace no, thank your brother. You so much. If I have, and one of the things I said, oh, and I saw your last message, is like, I'm a YouTuber, and I'm yeah. like, okay, you just. So, guys, now this is it. Look, Wadamaya made things so clear to Ivan about drama. Yes, he said he doesn't want drama. To me, I feel that it was like an indirect caution that he is giving Ivan. He wants to tell Ivan that he coming to his place. He doesn't want him to bring drama or live with drama. We all know what happened between him and Ayamarwa. Nobody can tell me that Wadamaya didn't see that or he didn't hear that. Because Wadamaya said himself that he watches Modesta Lifestyle. He watches Black Beauty. I know, even if he doesn't watch me, he has watched my video before. And he has watched other reactors' videos too before. So this drama that was going on between Ivan Sultan, you know, uh, uh, Modesta Lifestyle, Black Beauty, Marwa speaking against reactors, he saw it. He saw it. This is why... He's putting this question indirectly to Ivan. For me, in my own opinion, and reason why me, I feel that Wadamaya accepted Ivan to come to his place or to collaborate with him. Like I said, we know Wadamaya and Ayamara, they are not in good terms. Everybody will say they are cool, but in real life, they are not in good terms. There's no way Wadamaya who collaborates with Ayamara, unless maybe they settle their issues that they have. So, Ivan accepting Ayamara in America, everybody knows that yes, they had an issue, but still he accepted him. So, he writing to Admire that, okay, I'm coming to Ghana. I want to collaborate with you. Admire also knowing the story there already. He, he feels that if he says no to Ivan, one day, one day, Ivan can use this against him and say that, okay, because he is not in good terms with Marwa and I hosted Marwa, he doesn't want to accept me too. Wadamaya didn't want that story to come up. Wadamaya also himself, he wants to accept Ivan so that people out there who say that, oh, okay, uh, he is not in good, people are saying he is not in good terms with Ayamara. But here we are, a person who accepted Marwa and mingled with Marwa. Now, uh, what Maya has also accepted him, it means that, oh, he doesn't even care if the person has, you know, have 
any contact with Marwa. And still, life goes on. He has to accept him. This is what I think. And another thing is also that, look, I think that Marwa and Wadamaya, there is always a competition between them. There is always a competition. So Marwa collaborating with Ivan and Ivan getting the numbers and the views. Wadamaya is also trying to prove that, okay, Ivan is with me. Now, Ivan, after coming to me, he was he was at a certain number of subscribers. Now, Ivan has reached this number of subscribers. Now, Ivan has gotten this amount of views. You, you understand? Now, people say, okay, Wadamaya has more influence than I am Marwa. This is another reason. It's my own observation and my own opinion. This is how things are. But now, my question is, why is Wadamaya lying in this video? Why is he lying that he doesn't know what Ivan does on his YouTube channel? Why is he lying? Let's watch this video. And, you know, I, I, I'm not going to mention what happened, but some of you guys, you know, may know, like, you know, there's these um, videos that have been created and, and people are making stories up all the hey, time. Is this you guy's know? popular? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hey. I, are you popular? Like, no, I, I, I wish I, I wish I wasn't. Your channel. <laughs> hey. No way. I wish I wish I wasn't for that, you know, no, 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 but no, no. regardless. Check out <laughs> See, I, I'm so sorry I didn't do research about you, but... I know you're an African YouTuber, yeah, yeah, yeah. and I'm okay, but if people are talking about it, he's a big guy. <laughs> now, this is my problem. You see how Wadamaya is pretending here that he doesn't know Ivan is a big YouTuber, or people talk about Ivan. All he knows is that Ivan told him that I'm an African, I'm traveling to this, that, 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 and I'm a YouTuber. Now, look, as a person who observes so well, who sit down and think so well. Now, let's talk about this. Is Wadamaya trying to tell me that, me, as I sit here, if I write to him, Wadamaya, I'm, I'm here and so, so, and so, I want to collaborate with you. Wadamaya, if I say I'm a YouTuber, Wadamaya would just say, okay, come. Without him checking what I do on my channel, is he trying to tell us that? When I even contacted him, he never bothered to check Ivan's channel, what he does on his channel. That is a lie. That is a lie. I know Ivan and Wadmaya has been communicating. They have been communicating for a long time, even before Ivan decided to come to Ghana. So why is Wadmaya letting, you know, this kind of videos influence who he is? Why is he letting this video show clearly that he is trying to deceive people? It shouldn't be so. It shouldn't be so. Definitely, people who want to collaborate with you, you check what they do on their channel before you agree that, okay, I'll do the collaboration with you. Okay, the way you do your videos, I don't like it, so I'm not going to collaborate with you. This is how it is done. Now, somebody who you claim, you don't know what he does on his channel. He only said he's from Cameroon and he does YouTube. You just accepted him and brought him to your home. And even in the videos, you were revealing the kind of businesses. You were even ready to go show him your businesses that same day. The businesses you said, you are doing them low key and you don't want anyone to know. You were ready to go show the person your businesses, revealing things to him. Wadamaya, Wadamaya, there is no point in trying to lie. If you say that you've been chatting with this guy for a very long time, nobody can hurt you, nobody can harm you. If you say that you checked what this guy does on his YouTube channel, nobody will hurt you, nobody will harm you. So why are you saying that now you have to go check his channel? You didn't know that he, he is famous and people talk about him. Stop lying. You watch Modesta. You watch Black Beauty. You watch me sometimes. I know. You watch other reactors too. So why are you trying to lie to people over here? We shouldn't be doing that, bro. Don't let the influence of Ivan make you be a bad person. 
Don't let the influence of Ivan make you be twisting your tongue. I don't even know why Ivan brought up that issue of, you know, some people are trying, some people are trying to create force. He's talking about reactors. Reactors, we are here to say what we see. We are here to say what you people do. Only God knows the kind of conversations he will have with Wadmaya behind closed doors about Ayamara. Only God knows. Only God knows. You see, you have come to Ghana. You came to Ghana to explore. You didn't even explore one place before meeting other YouTubers. All you did is to enter Wadmaya's house. What is the main reason? What's the main purpose? Is it that you want to use the influence of Wadmaya to grow? To grow? You want to use the influence of Wadmaya to get the numbers and the views? Is that the main purpose why you came to Ghana? This is a question. My guys over there, Lazy Gang, Strive Family, Homeless Gang, this is a question I'm asking. If you guys think it's not necessary, let me know. You know, we give our opinions here without any fear. We just go straight to the point. We just say it on a hard way. We don't pamper anybody. To me, I feel that Wadamaya is pretending in this video. He knows Ivan. They've been chatting. He knows what we, what happened between Ivan, Modesta, uh, what happened between Ivan, Sultan, and Ayamara, and what happened between Ayamara, Modesta, and Black Beauty. He knows. So why is he doing that? Why is he doing that? Anyways, for me, I only came here to give my opinion and to judge what they said. Now, to Wadamaya, there is no need in lying. We all know that you are a truthful person. Yes, that is how we see you. But with this, I'm not going to agree with you. No. Because if we check one, two, three things, it doesn't add up. So please, up the game, 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 up the game. That's an advice I can give. Now, Ivan, be careful you don't go discussing Ayamaro's issue over there. It's past and gone. If you are with Wadmaya, deal with Wadmaya. Deal with Ghana. Don't go and deal with Kenya and Ayamaro. This is what we don't want to hear. We don't want any drama like the way Ayamaro said. Now, if you bring out the drama to we reactors, you will take it and make it loud. Since you guys want the attention, we will give you all the attention and the, you know, and the noise on YouTube streets. Anyways, guys, on here, we always strive for glory, we strive for success, we strive for travels, we strive for the truth. And today, we are striving for the truth. What am I? Don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Hit the notification bell so you become part of the Strive family. Like this video. Like this video. Leave a comment. Just tell me what you think. Whether Wedmire was lying or not. Let's know. No insults. No insults. Because these days, I don't want to be replying people in a harsh way. If you bring insults, I might delete your comments or block you. Yes. Now, I want to be the president of Block Nation too. Or I'll delete the late nation. Let's all have fun over here and learn. Your boy Melo Day. I'll see you in the next one. No more. If you know make money, friends, good dog you. Nobody said we love you. You for step up your hustle. Cause one day you gotta make it. If you know make money, friends, good dog you. Nobody said good love you. You for step up your hustle. Cause one day, cause one day. No you gotta love.